So Mike Gravel just got screwed by the DNC in a very transparent way. So Jordan says the following on Twitter here. So at Mike Gravel is getting bumped from the DNC debate because he hasn't hit the polling requirement. Instead, the DNC tapped several candidates who don't have as many individual donors. The thing is, Gravel hasn't even been offered as an option in many of the polls. Oh, boy. So do you understand what's happening here? Mike Gravel has hit the number of individual donors in order to be in the debate. But he hasn't hit the polling threshold. But the reason he hasn't hit the polling threshold is, at least in part, because he hasn't been offered as an option in enough polls. So instead, they're literally picking people who haven't hit the individual donor threshold. So this is them playing with the rules to get the outcome that they want to get. Color me the opposite of shocked about the DNC tweaking stuff in favor of their preferred candidates. Because that is exactly what this is. Now, everybody knows I've been super critical of Mike Gravel from day one. But having said that, there's nothing to do in this situation but defend him because he should be on the stage, especially since the more important metric he's hit. The number of individual donors, small dollar donors, that shows more grassroots support. And if he was offered as an option in more polls, he likely would have beat the people who they're letting in. So this is classic DNC fuckery. They need to switch this and they need to switch this immediately. I don't think they will do it, but that's messed up. And listen, I do also have to point out because it, I, it's super important. This is why, you know, they probably shouldn't have said, I'm not trying to win. Mike Gravel said originally when he launched, I'm not trying to win. The two teens that are basically running his campaign said like, oh, yeah, we're not trying to win. Why would you do that? Because now you've given them an out for when you go to them now and say, what do you mean? We hit the number of donors that, were, that are needed. That's going to be one of the points that they make back to you. Well, you said you weren't even trying to win. So what does it matter? We're going to give the spots to candidates who are trying to win who may not have hit the individual donor threshold, but have hit the polling requirement. So, listen, that was one of the things we factored in as to whether or not to let you on the debate stage, is whether or not you're trying to actually win and you're serious about this. So, I I'm, I'm telling you, that's... Even if somebody who's an ideological ally to Mike Gravel, like myself, had a problem with them saying, I'm not trying to win... Well, then obviously people who are not ideological allies with you are going to hold that over your head in a much more nefarious way. So that was a really terrible move to say that. Um, even if you believe that, you shouldn't have said it. But that's just um, my take on it. But anyway, it still is fucked up. They absolutely should let Mike Ravel in the debates. Um, and expect a lot more stuff like this from the DNC moving forward, because the DNC is still the DNC, and you gotta keep an eye on them, and you can't trust them for a second.